Cofactors are non-protein components required by enzyme to function properly. In this example, binding of cofactors to the active site of the enzyme allows the substrate to bind to the active site of the enzyme, which then allow formation of enzyme substrate complex. This shows that without cofactors, enzyme would not be able to function properly. Enzyme without its cofactor is also known as apoenzyme, which is in its inactive form. Binding of cofactors will activate the enzyme. This active form is called holoenzyme. Unlike cofactors, inhibitors are molecules that also bind to enzyme but it will decrease enzyme activity. Inhibitors will prevent formation of enzyme substrate complex. The two types of inhibitor are competitive and non-competitive inhibitor. Competitive inhibitors are molecules with similar structure to the substrate, therefore able to bind to the same active site as the substrate. Binding of inhibitor to the active site will prevent binding of substrate to the active site, hence less formation of enzyme substrate complex, thus reduces enzyme activity. Competitive inhibitor does not permanently damage the enzyme. Enzyme is still able to catalyze the chemical reaction if the inhibitor is removed. Unlike competitive inhibitor, non-competitive inhibitor binds to the allosteric site of the enzyme. Binding of the non-competitive inhibitor will lead to change in the structure of the active site. Thus, prevents formation of enzyme substrate complex. This reduces enzyme activity. Generally, we can see that both competitive and non-competitive inhibitor reduce enzyme activity by reducing the formation of enzyme substrate complex.